day, YouTube. Today we're going to take a little bit of a look at uh, Zorin OS uh, version 16, latest release on the left, and Windows FX 11, so a Linux distro as well on the right there, just to have a look at the CPU and a RAM comparison. So really, really basic quick video here. Now what I'm going to need to do is open up the terminal in Zorin, which I love Zorin, I've got to say. Uh, I've got this Ubuntu based, uh, ooh, oh, love the work, yeah, love the work. Uh, just what, what they do. Anyway, uh, let's move across to the HTOP, which is going to show us what we're working with here. So CPU, I idling out quite nicely, uh, whereas the RAM is at about, ooh, let's just punch that up so you can guys see that a bit better, 921 megabytes of RAM on boot up. Sorry, you probably want to read that. Uh, whereas Windows FX, so again, a Linux uh, distribution, faking Windows 11, is uh, running at about a little bit less, 850, 860 megabytes of RAM on boot up. Maybe 100 less or more, depending on how you look at it. But uh, really just a baseline RAM comparison video to be taken with a grain of salt, but I just wanted to let you guys know, uh, yeah, what's going on with these two here. I really love Zorin OS 16, so we're at the end of the video, but I might just go into a bit of a tangent here. Uh, Zorin OS is actually based off, well, these are both based off Ubuntu here, but uh, the whole point of um, Zorin OS is to uh, designed for newcomers to Linux really. Having said that, every Linux distribution sometimes says it's designed to be simple and easy to use for newcomers, but you know, is what it is. Uh, if I uh, have a look at the uh, some of the specs here, because this really is interesting to me. Yeah, it's a, it's a GNOME variant, which doesn't look very GNOME-ish. Uh, that's probably the reason why it's using a little bit too much RAM there, is because it's running on the, the GNOME desktop environment. But they've, they've beautified it for sure. Maybe one day this will be my main daily driver. But thanks for watching, guys. Please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button, and I do hope to see all of you guys there in the next one. Whoa!